Both athletes made low-key entrances to the VIP lounge. Chantal Entz, the determined amputee swimmer, and Carlos Green, the burly visually impaired shot putter and discus thrower. They were welcomed home by a full room of Paralympic Committee members, the Ministry of Sport officials, as well as friends and immediate family. President of the Paralympic Committee, Kenneth McKell, lauded the efforts of all involved. We went to London and we conquered London in different ways. We conquered London with our personalities. We conquered London with our gifts that we brought, which, which, which the, the, the IPC thought was one of the best set of exchange gifts that, uh, that they were around. We conquered London with our positive attitude. While the athletes, Ince and Green, shared their experiences, both vowing to do it all again in Rio. Seeing other athletes with different abilities, um, despite their challenges, um, overcoming them, it was truly, truly amazing. Oh, both of our distance, we, we did personal best, and we came out with, with a wealth of knowledge, a wealth of experience, and it it really was an eye-opener. The acting general manager of the airport's authority, Dayan and Burju, who spared no resource in both the send-off and welcome for the athletes, reiterated his own support. I thought it particularly poignant that we had the, the physical device that would light the way, but we also have the athletes who, by their dedication, by their training, by their participation, by their accomplishment and achievement, have also inspired us. They have lit the way as well. I am Jassy Marik reporting for CNC3 Sports.